Hello everybody, on this video I'm going to show you how to update your graphics and to get them into the position that you want them into. Okay, as you can see, the graphics are small and they're uh, not centered. So we go up to edit post. Usually this is on text. We want to put it on visual. That way you can see how it's going to look. And this is the way it's going to look, or the way it looks now. But this is the way people will see it. So you can edit it in real time. You click on the photo that you want to edit. Click on the pencil. Usually full size works better, but this is huge, so we're going to go with large size. And you want to center it and update. Now the total width of the column is 640 pixels. But if your picture is over 640, the program will automatically reduce it to fit in that space however it won't make it blurry if you try and reduce it it'll come out blurry especially with cartoons and I'll give you an example it's uh, the full size is 686 width by 495 so if we go to a custom size and let's say we put in 640 right here 640 you hit enter this will automatically go to the left you click at the center update and you look at it and it's blurry even though the full size is larger it's still going to come out blurry so edit again go to full size center is fine edit no longer blurry and you just go down with how many other graphics we have and that full size is 960 but that's fine because the program would automatically reduce it and this is a great example of how to use a newspaper clip inside your post we can't take we can't copy and post the entire article but what we can do we're reducing it what we can do is we can take an excerpt he took like the heading a little bit of it but he also right here put a link to it which is a great job another way he could have made a link is uh, let's say to Raw Story article. Okay, and if you want to make that a link, so here's the link of the story right here. Highlight that, copy it, so you have the link. Okay, yes, yes. now you highlight the words that you want to link to. You hit insert edit link and you put in the URL right here. Paste. And you want to open in another window. You want people to stay on this website. You don't want them going off the website. So you open link in a new window. You hit add link. And now this word right here, Roy Story article, is the same as this. You can do it with any word. So we'll take this out and we'll leave the article the way it was. And it's up to the author to change it the way he wants. But that's the way you change and you edit a link and add a link. Okay. 
here. Full size, update. Click, edit. Full size, update. Edit. Full size. Update. And we have done all of our edits. And we're in visual mode so we can see what the people will see. And we're done. Now we always, whenever you have any edits, you have to hit update. Otherwise they won't save. And if you look over here, it'll tell you that your article was updated. View post, post was updated. And there we have it. And that's all.